I'm here with Zoe Weil, who is the co-founder and president of the Institute for Humane Education. So can you tell me, what is IHE? Well, IHE, of course, is the Institute for Humane Education, which is an organization that has as its mission the goal of creating a humane and sustainable and peaceful and just world for everybody, for all people, for all species, and for the environment. And that's a big task. It's not something that you can easily bite off, but we have a way of helping to achieve that goal, and that is through education. So humane education examines the challenges that we face on this planet, which are myriad, and then gives students in age-appropriate ways the knowledge they need, the tools they need, and the inspiration they need to be what we call solutionaries for a better world. The way it started really was uh, in 1987 when I taught a summer course to middle school students. It was a week-long course. I was just looking for a summer job and uh, it, I taught several courses that summer. It was a program that was offered at the University of Pennsylvania and I watched as these kids were transformed in the course of a week. You know, came in on Monday, left on Friday with That's new amazing. ideas and one of them, David, who was in that very first course I taught, he went on to be an HIV AIDS advocate in New York City. He works for Mayor Bloomberg now. He's, mm -hmm. you know, in his mid-30s. I saw him a couple of years ago and I hadn't seen him in 18 years. And he came to a talk I was giving and I introduced him to some friends afterwards and I said, this is David. He was in the very first humane education class I ever taught. And before I even finished the sentence, he said, that course changed my life. Wow. Now he was 12 years old and that course changed his life. He, he remembered it that way. I uh, eventually hired more people to go into schools wow. too in different cities. So we had a program of going into schools in a variety of cities, mm -hmm. um, but it wasn't enough. I wanted this movement to grow. And so the reason why I co-founded the Institute was primarily to train other people so that this movement could reach millions, not just 10,000 kids a year. So I created the first certificate program and then graduate program, Master of Education program in humane education in the United States that covers the issues not only of education but of human rights and environmental preservation <laughs> and animal protection and what we call culture and change. You know, how are we influenced and how can we influence, how can we be change makers? We now have five different graduate programs offered through an affiliation with Valparaiso University. Mm -hmm. And then we do online courses, which people can take all over the world. Our graduate programs are also online, so we have teachers from all over the world who are getting their master's degrees with us. We've accomplished a tremendous amount in, in 15 years, but we're looking ahead to the next 15 years. And so we have a capital campaign, Creating the Future, and there are lots of things that we want to accomplish with this campaign. I mean, there are things that we really are on the cusp of achieving. We want mm -hmm. to grow these programs, expand them. We want to create solutionary kits for schools. We want to have a much bigger reach on our website. Right now we have a, an award-winning online resource for teachers around the world to use and we have free downloadable activities that anybody in the world can use. Mm -hmm. We want to expand that. We want to make every teacher anywhere mm -hmm. have access to exactly what they need to bring this to their students. Where we want to head in the future, I mean, I'm looking ahead to the million dollar endowment as mm -hmm. soon as we can get it. Mm -hmm. And I know that this is a tough time for people. And yet, what could be more important than investing what resources we have to invest in the future mm -hmm. of our children and of our planet? It's like being on the top of the pyramid where that funding then stretches down to reach potentially millions. Mm -hmm. That should be pretty exciting for people when mm -hmm. they're thinking about how can I invest in something that's going to make a difference. I mean, we have seven billion people on this planet, over one billion of whom don't have access to clean water, mm -hmm. don't have enough food to eat, 27 million of whom are living as slaves. I mean, that's the world that we're facing. We, global warming is happening at a rate that exceeds what scientists had predicted. We are facing the massive extinction mm -hmm. of so many species on our planet, we may lose half of them by the end of the century. These are crises that no other generation has faced. Mm -hmm. And our kids are facing it. And what tools are we giving them to solve these crises? That's what humane education does, and that's what we're trying to do. And we're trying to raise the money to do it.